Hello everybody and welcome to this next video. Welcome to Ivan Vlogs and uh, we are reacting to Steven Wilson's latest album The Harmony Codex. First one was Inclination, next one What Life Brings and now we're listening to Economies of Scale. So far uh, listening to the first two songs I'm having a good feeling. I think this is a conceptual album. Uh, as you know, I work, I'm work. i working at the moment as a driver and I have an hour and 20 minutes ahead of me waiting for my passengers, so hopefully plenty of time to listen to the whole album and share first impressions with you. Let's uh, dive right into it. Thank you for watching. Sorry. All right, first of all, uh, 
three songs into the album and I have the impression that Steven is uh, refusing to hire a drummer. Steven, what's the matter with drums? I'm not a drummer. Well, I play. I can play a little bit of. It's happening in the past few albums. He's going a bit, a bit uh, technological, a bit neo, a bit Depeche Modian uh, about it, and and maybe also the topics that he touches, the the, the things he sings about, and the, the themes of the songs are actually better reflected with electronic drum kits than. It takes a bit of rock out of it. Um, a little bit of rock, not saying that Depeche Mode, for example, Depeche Mode, even with electronic beats, to me, sounds like rock. Doesn't have to be all, all guitars. Like I've always said, Apocalyptica with cellos was more metal than some bands that didn't even play up to the genre. That piano part in the middle, I think... Boom, 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 boom. I think... Uh, I found it basic. I found it boring, to be honest. And I thought, okay, why? You know. But again, it hits me back to the point where, uh, as I said earlier, maybe the song and the theme of the song and that interlude is supposed to si to sound simple. You know, I'm a music guy. I don't pay attention to the lyrics at first. Like no mystery about the parts. Boom, boom, boom. By the third note, you already know he's gonna go with that, and he does, which he could, he might not actually do and make it a bit uh, unpredictable, you know, like he always likes to do. But the intro and the outro of the song, those harmonies, that singing and that theme, I really liked it. A bit short of a song to every song that I'm listening to is sounding a bit like an intro. Like an intro to what? I'm still like, I'm, 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 I'm waiting for something to break out. Does that make sense? All the songs I've heard so far feel like intros to another song. Let's go, let's go into the next one. And uh, we're gonna do the whole album, I think, and see you uh, on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.